Hey Duvall, it's Sam Hersom here from Prime Motor Cars Mercedes-Benz here in Scarborough, Maine. Uh, I wanted to put a quick video together of one of the cars you sent in. Um, now I did just sell one of the um, one of these to a gentleman down in Florida, uh, but this one is available, uh, ready for delivery if you so desire. Uh, 2021 GLE 53 W4, so it's the SUV style. Um, Beautiful polar white. This one does have the um, classic red and black Napa leather. Uh, so that's going to be a uh, very exclusive interior. Now the factory doesn't make a lot of those, but this particular GLE does have that. Uh, so that's definitely going to stand out uh, amongst the other GLE 53s on the road. Uh, up front, we can see that uh, distinctive grille to the AMG models. Uh, you can't get that unless the car is a true AMG model. This also has um, night styling, so you see some of the black elements along the front, uh, along the sides of the car, as well as the back. Um, those really uh, blacked out, not standing out, help um, show off the, the body lines of the car. For 2020, Mercedes-Benz totally redesigned the GLE, and I think they did a tremendous job um, at redesigning it. Really an excellent looking uh, car. So uh, blind spot monitoring in the mirror. This car has lots of uh, driver safety features, uh, active lane change assist, uh, radar based cruise control, um, lots and lots of uh, safety features on this particular car. As we come down the side, uh, keyless go is a big feature. This also does have the surround view parking package. So uh, as you're maneuvering in tight areas, whether it's a friend's house or parking lot uh, during Christmas time where there's very limited parking, um, you're going to be able to have an excellent view of the exterior of the uh, SUV. Now we come around back, you can see that AMG badging there along the GLE, excuse me, 53 here. Um, if we take a look down bottom here, step back, uh, you can see some of that AMG styling along with the night styling. You see the, the tailpipes are blacked out there and there. And this also has a trailer hitch. So not only is it going to get you where you're going in a hurry, um, it's also uh, relatively family friendly. This one has a third row, has a trailer hitch. Um, so you're, you're going to be able to, it's going to be able to be uh, driven like a family car. Um, so as I just mentioned, third row, here are the seats, uh, two seats back here three and then the two up front uh, these fold down very easily um, and they fold down flat as well um, we can fold those uh, that second row down from back here uh, if need be and that folds right down flat all together all right now let's head inside and I'll show you some things in there all right now that we're inside I do want to point out a couple things in here as I said uh, this classic red Napa leather uh, is very very exclusive um, not a lot made from the factory. Uh, the factory, for some reason, just ran out of them early. Uh, it does have dynamic inlays here, so it's kind of that suede look, AMG badging. Uh, of course, comfort headrests up top. Uh, these seats are, uh, are very comfortable. Uh, let's start up front. Panorama sunroof front to back all the way, so that's going to let in plenty of um, natural light. Um, we come down onto the armrest here. Plenty of storage in there. Uh, for whatever you may need. Get a good shot of that in here. And then we come further up the armrest. We have some different controls. Uh, this GLE does have the AMG Performance Exhaust, and you do have the ability to open up the baffles in it to give it a uh, more aggressive look. Uh, you can adjust the suspension. This has air rides, so that can be adjusted. Uh, traction control, all kinds of things. Further on up, we do have one of four ways to control Mercedes' new uh, M-Box system, the new user experience. This is one. Uh, we'll get to the other three here in a moment. Uh, we move further up, we do have dual cup holders here. Just in front of that, we do have a uh, wireless charging pad for your um, smart device. Apple CarPlay, Android Auto right there. It's a little dark in here, so it may be hard to see, but I assure you it is there. We move up, dual zone climate control here. Uh, this blue light here is part of the 64 different color ambient lighting feature that this has. Uh, we move up to the natural grain uh, wood trim. It goes great with this red interior. And then we get to the main screen of the infotainment center. Now, I talked about the touchpad being one way. Another way is touchscreen. This is 
all uh, touch screen, very responsive, uh, very simply navigated, um, very, very user friendly. We come over to the uh, instrument cluster. Now the car isn't running, but the ignition is on, so you're going to see some different lights here. But this whole setup is fully customizable. You can change uh, the, the gauges to uh, all kinds of different inf information. Engine temperature, transmission temperature, RPMs, all kinds of things. Uh, heads up display above. Um, as I mentioned, this car has a lot of safety features, uh, radar based cruise control, active lane change assist, emergency stop assist. Uh, some of those are going to be controlled here on the steering wheel. Uh, so as you're driving, they're going to be right at your fingertips so you're not fumbling around looking for different things. Uh, on this side of the steering wheel, these controls here, uh, this is the third way to control that infotainment center. So there is a little touch pad on the steering wheel. In the fourth way is by voice. Uh, now again, the car is um, in accessory mode, so it's not going to be, uh, we're not going to be able to uh, show you that right now because the car is in the showroom and it's uh, not recommended to be started indoors. Uh, all right, to wrap it up, um, this has all kinds of extra features. It does have the uh, heated steering wheel, heated and ventilated front seats. Uh, both seats are powered with uh, memory function. Uh, power windows, like I said, all kinds of different features. So if you want to come take a look at this car, um, give me a call, text, email, 207-831-7391. And uh, if you like this video, go ahead and hit the subscribe button uh, for more videos like this. We're constantly getting new inventory. Actually, we just got a couple cars in as we speak. So um, yeah, always updating our inventory and uh, putting out new videos of that inventory. All right, thanks for watching. Thank you.